Hi and welcome to tiduko.com. In this video we will talk about types of bonds and their advantages and disadvantages. To start first let's talk about types of bonds. The, we have a bullet bond, callable bond, puttable bond, convertible bond and inflation link bond. So what is a bullet bond? Bullet bond is a simple depth instrument that pays its fixed coupons annually or semi-annually while the principal can be only redeemed at the maturity. So there, uh, therefore the bullet bond comes with no options. The advantages of bullet bonds is that they are liquid, they are very easy to understand and they are exact in terms of cash flows. As there is no options, uh, everybody can exactly estimate their future cash flows. The disadvantages are that for investor is that in case of increasing interest rates, investors c cannot sell or, as it says, put the bond and therefore missing an opportunity to buy a bond with a higher interest rate. The next bond we're going to talk about is callable bond. The advantages of callable bonds is that uh, the callable bond is a bond when, where issuer is allowed to buy the bond before the maturity at a certain call price. The disadvantage for investor in this case is that the if issuer calls the bond, the investor will have to invest and look for another opportunity and probably will have to invest their money at a higher, at a lower interest rate. Sorry about that. In contrast to callable, we have a puttable bond. And puttable bond gives investor an option so to gives investor an option to sell the bond at the pre-specified uh, price. Having said that, if market rate goes above coupon rate, the investor will have a choice of selling the bond back to issuer before maturity day, the date. Therefore, the investor could have another opportunity to invest in a higher at a high interest rate. If the put option is exercised, the disadvantage for issuer is that the issuer will need to issue a new bond with a higher interest uh, rate. Uh, convertible bonds. The advantages for convertible bond is that it gives investor an option to exchange the bond for a certain number of shares of the company. The convertible bonds are usually issued by companies that are having problems raising a capital. So that leads us to their disadvantages. The market for convertible bonds is less liquid and that's due to issue in understanding and evaluating the price of the bond, if the price is right or not. And the last one is inflation-linked bond. And inflation-linked bond uh, makes coupon payments in relation to inflation and that's actually their advantage it gives investor a protection against the infla inflation and how it works is actually that if inflation goes up the payments are higher and opposite thank you again for watching t this video Pre and please visit our website at tiduko.com in case you would like to learn more about finance accounting strategy and Hopefully I'll see you again. Thank you and bye-bye.